Welcome. In this video, we'll embark on a journey to seamlessly transition your articles from Salesforce classic knowledge to lightning knowledge. Many users have faced challenges with classic knowledge, so let's explore how the migration tool can be your solution. Before we dive into the migration process, let's address some common pain points with Salesforce classic knowledge. Classic knowledge can be quite complex, making it challenging to find and manage articles efficiently. Collaboration options are limited, and it may not integrate well with the latest Salesforce features. Lightning Knowledge brings exciting benefits to the table. An intuitive and user-friendly interface. Improved search and navigation capabilities. Enhanced collaboration tools. Seamless integration with other Lightning components. Now, let's show you how to begin the migration using the Lightning Knowledge migration setup. Let's go. First, access the setup page by clicking on the gear icon and selecting Setup. In the Quick Find box, type Knowledge Settings. Click on Knowledge Settings. Now, tick the Enable Lightning Knowledge option. Don't forget to click Save. Next, let's use the Migration tool to smoothly transition your knowledge articles. Keep in mind, the Lightning Knowledge Migration tool works differently depending on whether your org is using one or multiple article types. Fully test the tool in a recently refreshed sandbox prior to enabling the migration tool in a production org. To do this, log in into your production org, click the gear icon, select Setup, type Sandbox in the Quick Find box and select Sandbox. Refresh a full sandbox and wait for it to be done. This may take some time due to the amount of data. Once this is done, Let's review the pre-migration checklist prior to running the tool. For more information, review the link in the description. For the purposes of this video, we will assume our org has multiple article types. Now, let's open the sandbox and click the gear icon. Click Setup, type in Migration, and then click on Lightning Knowledge Migration Assistant. Agree to the Terms of Service by clicking the checkbox and click Start. The first page will show the article types and custom fields that will be consolidated into one new knowledge object. Click Next. The next page will show the article fields being mapped to the new fields for each article type. The Migration tool will try to match the field names, however you can select alternative field names by clicking on the drop-down in the New Field box. Once that is completed, click Next. If you have any files that you want to bring over, you can do so on this page. Click Internal or All Users. For this example, let's select Default Visibility to All Users. Click Next. The last page is to confirm starting the migration. Before doing so, remind users of the org not to revise any articles during the migration process. Click Begin. The next page will show the migration process. Refresh the page as needed to see the updated status. Please be patient as the tool migrates your data. This may take some time depending on the volume of your articles. Once the migration is complete, the data summary page appears under activation. This page will show any issues during the migration process. To finish the activation phase, click Next. This step will disable old article types and enable lightning knowledge. Click Activate. The green check mark next to each item will indicate 100% migration with no issues. Any yellow flag will appear next to items that did not migrate. Once you click Accept the migration, all old article types will be deleted. The results will depend on the size of the knowledge base. Once done, Carefully review the Lightning Knowledge post-migration checklist. After testing and reviewing the Lightning Knowledge, the same migration will need to be done in production. To enable the Lightning Knowledge migration tool in production, you will need to log a case with Salesforce support. Allow one to two weeks advance notice from the target migration date. The support team will ask questions about the migration plan and the results of the sandbox test. Click on this article on the Lightning Knowledge Migration tool to learn which questions they will ask. 
Here are some pro tips to ensure a smooth transition. Communicate the transition plan clearly with your team. Document your migration process for future reference. Consider a pilot group for testing before full migration. Reach out to Salesforce support if you encounter any issues. Here are some additional considerations as you transition from Salesforce classic knowledge to lightning knowledge. No backward compatibility. Once lightning knowledge is enabled, you cannot switch back to classic knowledge. Loss of some classic features. Certain classic knowledge features may not be available or function differently in lightning knowledge. Potential user training. Users may need training to adapt to the new Lightning Knowledge interface and features. Customization considerations. Some customizations in Classic Knowledge may not transfer seamlessly to Lightning Knowledge. Review and adjust articles. Existing articles may need review and adjustment to fit the Lightning Knowledge format. Documentation and support. Ensure your team is aware of the limitations and consult Salesforce documentation and support for guidance during the transition. Congratulations! You've successfully transitioned to Salesforce Lightning Knowledge using the Migration Tool. You're now equipped with a more efficient knowledge management system. To recap, in this video, we highlighted how to use the Lightning Migration Tool to move your knowledge articles from Salesforce Classic to Salesforce Lightning Interface. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or visit us on the trail at trailhead.salesforce.com. Thanks for watching.